Hi, my name is Bettina Ohnesorge. I work here on the beautiful island of Film in the International Academy for Nature Conservation. We are a department of the German Federal Agency of Nature Conservation. Um, the main part of my work consists in conceptualizing and organizing national and international symposia and workshops all related to different various topics of nature conservation. I'm very happy to work here because I get in touch with a lot of different topics related to environmental conservation. I work with a lot of people from different thematic and cultural backgrounds and I always loved nature and being outdoors and I wanted to end up in a job where I can make a contribution to its protection and conservation. On the other hand, I was always interested in international cooperation. I wanted to go abroad during my studies and I wanted to get in touch with a lot of people from different cultures. And that's why I was very happy to discover and study ERM. Hi, my name is Diana Noack and I studied uh, ERM as a Bachelor of Science in 2004 to 2007. Uh, since I graduated, I have been working for Swiss Environment in Paris, France, and after that I went to Warsaw, Poland to work for Veolia. And nowadays I work for IPP Hydro Consult. We are an environmental engineering company and I work here as a project engineer. And the reason why I chose ERM was because I was always interested in environmental science and engineering. Um, and the fact that there was a mandatory semester abroad included ERM was the reason for me to choose to study as well because I had already been abroad at, uh, before in my high school times and I thought that studying environmental science in a global context would be ideal for me. Um, and the third criteria I chose ERM was um, that the curriculum was quite interdisciplinary because the classes offered uh, a combination of natural, social and uh, economic sciences. And that's why I studied ERM. Students of environmental and resource management like Diana and Bettina were, prepare themselves for the upcoming dialogues about global warming, pollution, desertification and many more environmental issues. Here at the BTU Cottbus Senftenberg in the ERM program, you will acquire knowledge in environmental sciences, environmental management and environmental engineering. But nonetheless, both careers follow the same philosophy. Our environment has three major constituents. There's air, soil and there's water. All of which we have to maintain and protect. How? Through environmental sciences, like for example maths and physics, soil sciences, and also waste sciences, like Mr. Christian here is doing. The second key component to ERM are environmental technologies. Among other things, we get to know their potential and their appliance. Through the fields of economics and social sciences, on the other hand, we analyze the fundamental principles of the problems at hand. This is at least as important as any other science in the curriculum, because this is what brings the potential changes to effect. And to encourage and school global thinking, every year Emmy spends a semester abroad. You see, ERM is quite the interdisciplinary study course. With those acquired abilities, you will be able to play along in the environment's future hot topics. Naturally, studying at the BTU doesn't limit itself to hitting the books in our beautiful library, but also offers many other fun activities, like on-campus festivals, or you can try incredibly tasty food at the World Food Court of Cottbus International. All that in one place, the BTU Cottbus Senftenberg. I am ERM. I am ERM. We are ERM! Woo!